each and every one of you here. So my name is Kimberly Schultz. I handle South Region Communications for FCA, so represent a variety of our brands, including Chrysler. And so today we'll take you through this beautiful 2017 Chrysler Pacifica. Uh, today with me here are several team members uh, that will walk you through the vehicle. Uh, first of all, it's going to be Patrick Keats. He's, um, he's been on the minivan team for a while and saw the birth of this and gets to see it to fruition, which is wonderful. And then our designer is Chris Benjamin, who's been with uh, Chrysler for many years as well. And he'll take you through just exactly how wonderful the design is, the exterior and the interior, kind of point out some of those key features that we want to make sure you experience while you're driving the route. So without further ado, I welcome Patrick. Thank you. Thank you. We're really excited um, to, get, to get this vehicle out there in the marketplace and start hitting uh, showrooms already last month. Um, starting to get some great feedback from customers about the experience that they're having with the vehicle, how quiet it is, um, how the ride and handling so much more improved over the previous generations that we've had as well, and really just touching base on all the features and content on this vehicle that we offer. And I think that's one thing that you'll see with this vehicle is we've really packed it full of a lot of features, a lot of content um, that really speak to you know, not only, um, you know, moms out there that have driven the vehicle in the past, has really changed as far as with the way of parenting as well. This vehicle speaks to not only the kids in the vehicle, the teenagers, whether it's moms, dads, it really has something for everybody in the vehicle. And that's what the great thing is with this product, um, that it's, it really provides an essential tool for modern day parents. And we know that parenting has changed over the years, that, you know, parents' lives are obviously very chaotic from taking the kids to school to drop them off at afternoon after school activities to doing those landscaping projects on the weekend to taking those short vacations and those long vacations that we all deserve. And this vehicle really speaks to that and provides something for everybody in the vehicle. And one of the things that when you look at with modern day parents, um, you look at you know why, why do we even continue minivan? You look at the marketplace itself as well. The previous generation of minivan had over 78 minivan firsts. This vehicle alone has 37 minivan segment first, just on this vehicle alone. And that truly speaks to the name change on the vehicle because we want to redefine as far as what the segment is and what it offers to modern families and our modern day parents out there in the marketplace. What the minivan does for parents in one day, it would take two to three vehicles to accomplish that in that same chaotic lifestyle and the chaotic day that the parents go through every day with their kids and their families. The other thing you look at as far as the segment itself, it's relatively healthy. It's over a little bit over 500,000 units. Um, it's been relatively stable over the last five years and we're looking at to continue um, with the forecast over the next five years as well, uh, relatively on those numbers. But the other thing we found with a lot of the research out there is that uh, between now and 2025, uh, families with children under the age of 13 is gonna grow by four million. That's gonna equate to over two million units out there in the marketplace for family vehicles overall. And that creates, as far as another opportunity for us, not to only just target you know, minivan buyers, but also just young families that are coming out there in the marketplace that need all the, these uh, features and content that we packed into this vehicle and really speak to you know, those modern day parents and provide the best fit for the entire family. And we looked at you know, overall, as far as you know, five key areas, we looked at design, we looked at versatility, comfort, um, we looked at as far as uh, fuel efficiency, technology, safety features on the vehicle, and the first thing that really stood out and that people have been noticing is obviously the outstanding design, whether it's the exterior and the interior. Um, from our you know, optional 18-inch wheels, standard 18-inch wheels, optional 20-inch wheels on the vehicle as well. Um, no one else offers that out there in the segment. Um, and we move on to you know, some of those areas like um, the uh, you know, convenience features of the vehicle. Uh, Hands-free sliding doors and lift gate will be offered on the vehicle as well. It'll be standard on the limited model. Um, in addition, he talked about the uh, integrated vacuum, which is a great feature. And then you look at, I want to touch on some of the points that he made as far as with versatility and functionality. This vehicle has over 243 different seating configurations in it with the eight passenger seats. Okay. 243. So, so as he talked about, it, as far as all the different types of cargo, um, all the different functionality that you can use the vehicle for, that's why people, you know, purchase minivans. They want this functionality. They want to be able to, you know, put one seat one side down, the back seats up, back seats down, all this different types of functionality. And that's what the next generation Stone Go really offers with this vehicle. It really helps make this vehicle stand out. The other feature I wanted to mention as well with the Stone Go seating is also the easy tilt seating. So now the seats in the second row actually tilt forward. 
So what that allows us to do is, as far as it allows easy access, obviously, into the third row, but in addition to that, you don't have to remove a child seat anymore. So it's a great feature for parents getting in and out of the vehicle, get your kids easily into the back of the third row, and then put your child in the child seat and go on your way. So it's a great convenience feature that we have on there, on the vehicle as well. Another feature that we offer on the Stone Go seat seating, it comes standard right from the start, is Stone Go Assist. So in the past, our seats would fold and tumble. Now they're basically, and you also had to push on the driver's seat, you had to push it and hold your finger on the button, the power driver's seat, to push it all the way up and forward before you could stow the seats. Now there's a button right on the B-pillar, you push it, seats automatically slide up forward, allows you to fold the seat down and go right easily into that stone go bin. Push the button again and remove it brings it right back to its original position. So another really great convenience feature is that we know that our current customers, our current loyal customers will appreciate um, along with the new buyers that are coming into the segment. The other thing that we looked at with this vehicle as well was obviously uh, packing it full of safety features. This vehicle, vehicle has over 100 standard or available safety and security features on the vehicle. We have things like adaptive cruise control with stop and go. So if a car's, you set your cruise control and the car's pulling in front of you, um, it'll slow down to that speed. Then from that point, when they pull into the other lane, it allows you to basically go up to that speed again, up to that speed that you have set in the system. In addition, we have forward collision warning. Um, you'll hear a lot about uh, you know automatic emergency braking out there in the marketplace. We're the first FCA product to really bring that to uh, all of our models. We offer that forward collision warning with, uh, with stop as well. Um, it provides a big brake signal, pulses your brakes when uh, cars are stopped in front of you and you're, and you're going at a high speed. Um, in addition to that, we have things like surround view camera, um, parallel and perpendicular park. So there's a lot of models out there that might have uh, parallel parking. Um, this has perpendicular parking as well. So great features like that that, that provide um, you know that safe and secure uh, feeling of getting from point A to point B, and then finally we looked at you know how do we separate ourselves from the competition with you know the previous DVD systems that we've had in the vehicle. Chris touched on our UConnect theater system, so two ten two ten inch touch screens built into the second row, and the great thing again we talk about um, you know in the past bringing your DVDs into the vehicle. You always had you know, CDs that you brought in the vehicle, then we you know, provided streaming, now you bring your DVDs in the vehicle. Well, now we have a USB video uh, input that's right in the front, so you can download your DVDs right to that USB video stick, plug that into the front row, and you can shoot a different movie to uh, one screen than the other. You can shoot the same movie to both screens at different times. So it really provides this new application to the vehicle that really you know, it speaks to not only kids, but teenagers and adults when they're in that second row. You can plug in um, things like, obviously, your devices in the back. You can play uh, different things at different times, so your Xbox and, and PlayStation. And we look at it as really opens up a lot of different applications, like if you're a real estate agent and you want to show the next house that you're going to see, you can shoot those into the back. If you want to give uh, even a, a download on a business meeting as you're driving to the, the airport, you can show the presentation in the back and kind of debrief everybody on what's happened as far as from the meeting. So again, we look at that there's a lot of different applications and it really differentiates, differentiates ourselves from the competition on just this old DVD system that's put in the vehicle. You still can run Blu-ray DVD in the vehicle, but it provides this new application that you can plug in you know, an HDMI and you can, as far as mirror even your devices out there, onto the screen. So many times when you're looking down at your phone and you're trying to see things and go through your emails, you can basically just plug that into the second row and it'll show up right on the screen. So it lo allows a lot more capability than what we've had in the past. And it's something that you know, truly provides not only you know, the most kid-friendly vehicle, uh, the most family-friendly vehicle, and the most technologically advanced vehicle out there in the marketplace. Um, some of the games as well that we've talked about, one thing that I like and I like to mention as well is the bingo game. We have tic-tac-toe and checkers that you can play against each other, but the bingo game actually, how many times do you see your kids are focused right on their screens all the time when you're on a trip or going to school or whatever it is? With the bingo app, you actually have, you have to find different things outside of the vehicle, things like stop signs and airplanes and trees. So it allows the kids to actually look outside the vehicle and experience things that aren't just right in their computer screen all the time. So we truly try to think of a little bit of everything that really builds up, you know, what's in the family, who's driving in the vehicle, whether it's mom, dad, the kids that are in the back, the grandparents that are driving in the vehicle, really provides something that is truly the best fit for the entire family. And that's the end of my presentation. Thank you for your time.